The Hopkinton Relay for Life is attempting to raise $37,000 in 37,000 seconds on Giving Tuesday, which is the Tuesday after Thanksgiving. So I'm here to talk about the um, $37,000 in 37,000 seconds challenge that the Relay for Life of Hopkinton is taking on this year. So Relay for Life, uh, it's been going on in Hopkinton for a long time, and it's basically a lot of people uh, sign up and we raise money, and then at on a Friday night in May, we walk for 12 hours around the track, and we walk from 6 p.m. to 6 a.m., and it's kind of symbolic of a cancer patient struggle, and uh, the money that we raise goes to American Cancer Society. So the challenge is something new that we're doing this year on Giving Tuesday, which is the first Tuesday after Thanksgiving, and it's supposed to be um, a day where you give to charities. And the challenge is basically in 37,000 seconds, which is roughly like eight hours, we are, um, doing like a telethon and we are basically just encouraging people to go on during that time frame and donate how much ever money they want to and we're trying to reach $37,000 in the 37,000 seconds. Um, so basically the 37,000 came from the number of cancer patients that will be diagnosed in 2017 in Massachusetts. It's an estimate but that's what they're projecting and it just came about with us thinking um, you know people have like we encourage people to donate all the time but if we kind of give them this time frame and we give them this idea and we have a goal that's very specific, we think it'll really encourage people to get on and donate right there and then rather than putting it off. So the telethon will basically be reaching out to uh, phone numbers from the phone book all across Hopkinton, but the people that are already involved, we're encouraging them to go on and donate the way they normally would, which is through the Relay for Life website. And you can donate to either a specific participant, which is what a lot of family members do, or you can donate to the event in general, which is what people who just want to donate to the cause do and we're encouraging them to just go online. They put in credit card information and they basically donate to our event. Okay, and uh, how did you get involved with the uh, Relay for Life? So I've been doing Relay for Life for about six years now. I started in uh, seventh grade and I got involved through my sister who was actually in the same position as me. She was a uh, ELT lead on the committee and um, I just, I started attending the Relay for Life on her team. We do it in memory of my mom who passed away nine years ago and then when she graduated, there was an opening for the ELT and I had been part of it and I had kind of attended meetings with her. So they reached out to me and I, I was like happy to do it. I'm really committed to this cause, so.